what's up guys and what's going on you guys are welcome back to my channel and this channel i'm sorry and this episode i've done a little bit of mix up to the team i have put every player in different positions and we are going to see what results we are going to get in a campaign mode game so i've used you an all black goalkeeper as on the center forward savage as the left winger rodri for man city as a right winger um the Jane, is a La Liga player. I'm not really sure of his team. The attacking midfielder with two goalkeepers in defensive midfield. Messi and Dybala as the centre backs. Um, a goalkeeper again as the right back. Ederson. Um, I did a little bit of cheating with this player. Um, Lewandowski as left back and Oshiman of Napoli as the goalkeeper. Let's get into the opening team. So our openers before us today is going to be a fully and well positioned squad unlike ours with Aubameyang, Mbappe and Hazard up front, Messi in attacking midfield, Barella as a central midfielder with Buffett, Zaha and Asensio, I think they are wing-backs in this game. John Stones and Ruben Diaz are the centre-backs, I don't really know how to pronounce the third guy's name so let me not spoil it. And we have Brent Leno, the German stopper as the goalkeeper, let's get in the game game. And into the game, it is Torino as our model team with facing, I don't know how to pronounce the name, so let me not just spoil it. So, Abamia kicking off here with the ball back to Ruben Diaz in central defensive position. And Messi doing perfectly well there to foul Abamia who tried to hit the ball. Oh, he was offside. So, that's going to be our free kick. So, it's going to be Victor Oshiman, our newly pronounced shot stopper. To take this free kick so um oliver oh sorry that's manuel noya a true ball to oliver khan to djen and back to all black and <laughs> oh it's a beautiful goal from Jan all black taking his positioning there like a well pronounced striker if i should say and his positioning there and his movement there to just put the defenders off and score that goal was just amazing you wouldn't even believe that he's a goalkeeper and his first touch wasn't really that good but he still got the goal the ball under control and he took the shot and got the goal so we are one goal up and this is really looking good and so now into the second half and sorry first in the first half and while i'm talking and looking for words to say abamyang just got to go so easily heading over i think that's dibala there and anyway you don't really expect messi or dibala to handle a play like that because they are not exactly tall strikers i would say because just look at that dibala just looked up and saw abamyang up front and he wasn't gonna get that And we are kicking off this second. Um, I think this is like the third kickoff of this match, and I'm just thinking of how I'm going to get the goal. And oh, see your black and oh, and it's a goal. All black scores the third game of the goal, and he gets the second goal for himself. And I just keep on wondering how he keeps on making the runs, man. Because um, I don't think okay, okay, maybe it's the game, but um, him being that fast is just incredible like just take a look at his run man and warming his way into that box getting and i just keep on saying and that pass from the gen on whatever his name is to all black was just superb and him getting that goal is so crucial in this game because i don't really think we'll get so much goals in this game and it's pretty working out good and hazard into the box and woo, what a save from Oshi, man. I didn't expect him to make at least any save in this game, man. Can't come into the foul there. And it is the first set piece of the match. John Stones taking this one to Mbappe, to Messi, and a kind of sloppy pass to Aubameyang. And it's back to Hazard, and it's a goal. Hazard heading the ball into an empty net no goalkeeper no defender no one was there it was kind of an easy goal and this match has been completely end to end go to go thanks to your no black though but as expected i didn't expect my defense to do much but that was the first uh, good initial save from Oshman there he couldn't really do anything about the second and he's been really decent in this game hasn't been making too much mistakes but a normal goalkeeper should be 
holding that ball or pushing it into a safe environment i would say to avoid the rebound Ooh, savage touch letting him down there anyway that's a touch of a defender so i wouldn't complain and the throwing was just straight to him and Noya finding a nice true ball back to savage i'm not going to cross the ball because of the people in the box all black with the ball back to Noya. Noya shooting it to the post and ooh, that was a close one him getting to the ball and trying to get the rebound but that didn't work at all and the ball has been punted out of play Rodri with the ball through to Obla. Can this be a chance? Obla with a heavy touch and still trying to get the ball with good and hard pressing and forces the ball out of play. It's a throwing. You know, the adventure and the pressure from Obla in this game has been real crazy and from a goalkeeper that's really unexpected. Savage, sorry, that's the gen with the ball deflected and back with the opponent. The counter-attack is on but hopefully Messi and Ederson doing well there. And it's half time. Good pressure and good work rates from the team i didn't really expect this much two goals gone and two goals considered let's get into the second half shall we a high ball pointed for abamiang and he takes the shot and it's off the post off to Oshman and hopefully he can make the save. Sorry, thankfully. So Messi with the true ball back to Ederson. I'm going to see what I can do with the counter attack. And Ederson, wow, doing a lot of work there and he just ran out of gas towards the end. But nice adventure from him. Dijen back to Savage, back to Jan Oblak. Oblak completely misses the target just wide. He didn't completely miss it though, but he was just just wide off the target. And if he had gotten that goal, our lead would have been restored. In this second half, our defense with Messi, Ederson, Dybala and Lewandowski has actually done pretty well keeping Aubameyang off B, except for that chance he had in the second half. Rodri has the opportunity to cross to Savage and that is the importance of having a center back on your wings. Nobody is beating him with the header there and he was just completely free and thundered the ball into the back of the net. It's 3-2 and our lead has been restored. Wow, just look at the ball from Rodri on his left foot, his weak foot to Savage and Savage completely thunders the ball into the net and our lead has been restored. 3-2. And we are into kickoff. Abamyang getting the ball back to Messi. Messi with a true brilliant ball to Abamyang. And Abamyang takes the shot from like 25 yards out and he scores a screamer. That was a beautiful goal. Even a regular goalkeeper will have problems keeping that out. Even a regular goalkeeper doesn't have a chance of keeping that out. Not to talk of Victor Oshime, the center forward for football club Napoli. He's not going to keep that out, that's impossible. And Messi just trying his best to hold Aubameyang off, but there's no stopping the Ivorian. Oh, is Aubameyang Ivorian? I'm not sure, but there's no chance of stopping that goal. Beautiful goal from Aubameyang. And we have the opportunity with Johan Oblak, and he just completely misses the touch, and he was set off balance, and he wasn't, he didn't have the opportunity to take the shot. So we are into 3-2, sorry 3-3 three, three, and the match is still and they just took the lead for the first time in the match. That's just terrible defending from Dybala. Oh, I really expected him to kick that out because I don't even think that was my fault. That was my fault. I didn't press clear. 
in that situation if not Dybala was supposed to be kicking that out that was a low cross not a high cross a low cross is the one that comes from the bottom and he should really be kicking that out with his leg I think I pressed the clear button oh I didn't I didn't there Aubameyang just bends down and I think that is his hat trick he completes his hat trick of the match and that's just so painful man with the hard work of Oblak and Savage and Rodri in the front and scoring three goals, we still lose in the game. Then the true ball to Rodri, can he get to it? And no, he just doesn't have the pace. And this is this should be pretty game set and match here with with Zaha. Rodri and Noya almost got the ball back, but Zaha was strong enough. This is game set and match, and it is. 4-3 this is kind of painful though because of the way all black and because of the goals that all black and um, the goals all black and savage got in this game were pretty good and they should have really taken care of the game and gotten us the win but we couldn't defend properly and we couldn't keep Aubameyang in place and he got three goals in this match our major problem in this match was Aubameyang Messi and Dybala were unable to stop him but no worries there will be a part two of this episode where I will get the win I assure you that so if you guys want to see the part two of this displacement episode I would say <laughs> in this displacement episode please like subscribe and hit the notification button so you see it when the video comes back thank you and good night.